BNF and AI, the ultimate travel companion in the National Library of France, BNF's digital roadmap on the footsteps of artificial intelligence, AI. Today's itinerary from the digital roadmap of the National Library of France will let you discover the fundamentals of AI. Using this map's five-step itinerary, we'll explore the following five issues. One, how is AI making its way into the BNF today? Two, which dreams could come true thanks to AI at the library? Three, what are the core elements of an AI-based project? Four, what does an AI-based project require to thrive? And five, to conclude, what is the library's strategy regarding AI? Let's go. BNF and artificial intelligence. The principle of AI is to use material and software devices to understand and perform tasks that require human intelligence and thinking, like seeing, listening, or learning. One, how is AI making its way into the BNF today? First, some curious-minded people proved to be very interested in these technologies. They develop their skills and create prototypes. All that you see on this map represents a playground for them. They meet other researchers as curious as them and together they get involved in common research projects. That's how the library can test its collections and experiment with software currently used by other devices such as your smartphone. For example, when you take a photo of a text whose words are then recognized by the machine. But like any other technology, AI has been developed by the BNF just because it is able to deal with today's challenges. For example, how can increasingly massive amounts of content and data be managed and explored? How can services for the users be constantly improved? Similarly, the TAD, the automatic shuttle system used to carry the different documents in the library, was created 25 years ago to manage items distribution. Two, what dreams could come true thanks to AI at the library? Let's talk about five dreams. One, studying making discoveries in the collections, analyzing them. Two, searching, improving query facilities in the digital library, Gallica and beyond. Three, interacting, developing content management tools, interfaces, chatbots, in order to help users find their way about the library, make the most of our service, or in order to make recommendations to them. Four, cataloging, assisting the work of librarians. Five, managing, improving the way the library monitors its activities. For instance, when deciding which documents most require conservation operations. Three, what are the core elements of an AI-based project? There are three of them. AI needs data, but not just any sort of data. It must be documented and be of high quality. In that respect, the library is a real wonderland due to the richness, the variety, and the originality of its collections and due to its policy regarding data. AI also needs processing power, servers, infrastructures. Lastly, it requires skills and time to develop these skills through many tests and errors, the only way to ensure that the machine's results can be trusted. Four, what does an AI-based project need to thrive? First of all, you need a community, partnerships, skills, skill sharing. The Data Lab was created to meet this goal. Rules, a legal framework and ethical principles are also fundamental, especially when copyrighted content or personal data are to be explored or when new services and new recommendation systems are to be designed for the users. Lastly, AI-based projects require investments, for example, in the field of image, image recognition technologies in order to reach advanced developments. Considering all these issues, the library decided to refine its strategy and bring together its different projects and desires regarding AI in a roadmap launched in spring 2021. To find out more, click this link. Thanks for your attention.